What's up, everybody? Matt Gunnipson here. We're coming to you with another exciting video, another digital rock star. I've got Janine here all the way from Vietnam, who's got an amazing story to tell. And she is a digital rock star, which means she's generated at least $10,000 in a 30-day period inside her digital growth community. And uh, Janine, what were your sales just in the last 30 days? Yeah, so we made $21,000 in 33 days. $21,000. That's amazing. Wow. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. And, and thank you, by the way, for taking the time to do this interview. Mm -hmm, of course. Thanks yeah. for having me. So, so I, I, I'm sure everybody would love to hear because you, you have a really interesting story to tell. T take us back to, you know, what was it like before you got started inside the digital growth community and, and your progression through it and, you know, how you got to where you are now? Yeah, for sure. So, we are a world schooling family. So we just started traveling about 10 months ago. And honestly, when we first started traveling, we were just kind of struggling. Like we had a lot of different businesses, a lot of different things going on. You know, the time zones compared to the States is like literally opposite. And so we were like up in the middle of the night, we were up late, waking up early. My husband literally worked in the middle of the night and it was just really hard. It was hard because especially when we'd be with community and stuff, we would miss out on a lot of different things because we just had to, you know, keep up all these businesses because we're traveling, we're traveling with four, four boys right now. And so it's just, you know, it's a lot to be able to do all of that. And, you know, I've been a part of um, network marketing, you know, high ticket affiliate marketing, like lots of different things. Um, and honestly, just never made a full-time income and was never able to hit that. And so when I heard about this, like it was just such a game changer for us because I knew we needed a breakthrough because we had gotten to the point where my husband had just sold his insurance agency. He just sold it back in April and we were like, we had debt, like when we started traveling, like we were just like trying to make it work. And yeah, we were spending about the same as we would if we were living in the States, living in a house, but you know, traveling. And so there's just like a little more uneasiness. Like it's nice to have a little bit of a cushion. And so when he was selling his agency, he had like five streams of income lined up. Like, this is what we're going to do. And, and three of them like fell through the week before he was selling. And we were like, what do we do now? And especially considering like, this was like the fourth or fifth time he was selling. And so we were like, we just like prayed over it. We're like, all right, we still are supposed to sell. Like we're still going through with this, but now what, you know? And even one of the things was one of those like crypto trading bots that rugged. And, you know, initially it's like, oh, you know, you're not going to be able to access your money for 24 hours. And we're like, oh, okay, that's not great. And then, you know, a couple of days go by and they're like, it's coming back. We're going to get it back up and running. And then it's starting to feel like, oh, maybe it's not going to be okay. And then like a few days later, it's like, okay, they're not coming back. Like we lost $30,000 doing that. And, or it's just like, oh, it just like punch in the gut, you know, like just with everything going on. And I remember like us just walking down the street in Thailand and we had been there for a couple months. We were there with community. It kind of like felt like home, but we were getting ready to leave. And so it was like all this uneasiness and just like talking through, like, what are we going to do now? Like, I mean, you know, obviously we're, we're not going to be homeless. Like, you know, we are, you know, not like in a dire situation, like right at this moment, but it was just like, what are we going to do? You know, like we need to figure out a way to like, be able to support ourselves and be able to replace that income. And so, um, so yeah, coming into this space has just been a breath of fresh air, really like, because we know we're all about, a, you know, multiple streams of income, but let's be honest, you can't just keep adding businesses in, right? You can't like, you run out of time. And so when I found out you could do this in just two hours a day, I was like, this is, this is going to be a game changer. So I'm super grateful to have found this and to be here. Yeah. And it's super cool having you on this interview. Now, what, uh, you know, what actually had you find the digital growth community? How did you actually find it? 
Yeah. So I am part of a, um, actually a Christian community of, um, for personal professional development. And it's, um, it's a network marketing business. And one of the girls that I am in with that had come here and made $16,000 in a month. And so I know her personally, like she's someone I've met at conference and stuff. And so I, when I heard that, I was like, I was like, you're doing what? I was like, I got to hear more because I was like, seriously, you can make that kind of money just working two hours a day. I was like, that sounds too good to be true, but I knew her. So I knew that it was true, you know? And so, um, just gosh, I'm so grateful. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. I just, um, I just got to say like, I'm hashtag jealous, you know, you got the traveling lifestyle. Uh, you're, you're basically, you know, you're doing the dream that a lot of people dream about. Um, that must be really cool. It is. It's a lot of fun for sure. Definitely yeah. been a of mine for a long time. Yeah. Oh man. I just, I admire your courage for that. You know, it sounds like you and your husband are, yeah, you just have faith and you just go for it. It's, it just sounds really cool. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah. It definitely takes some courage. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, for sure. So, um, Janine, I always like to, I know you got to get going, but I always like to end the interview with like a really good tip. So, you know, for those who are just getting started out, maybe they're looking from the outside and they're looking at this. What would be a tip for somebody who's just getting started in this business? What would you tell them? You know, a um, couple of things. One is part of the reason I was so excited to get started here is because I just see so many people that like if they commit and they're coachable and they are consistent like they're winning. Like I just see mm -hmm. so much of that happening and that's what makes me feel so good about sharing it with others. Mm -hmm. And so keep that in mind as you're starting, like as you're starting, keep in mind that you're, you are going to help and change so many lives with this. So like, keep that in your forefront. And then also, um, just go for it. Just don't be, don't be scared. Like you have to kind of push through, I think, especially if you're new to online business, like, I feel like you almost have to push through a little bit of that, um, you got to push out of your comfort zone a little and be able to like get out there and do the things. But as soon as you do, and you start being consistent with it, you just get better and better. And so like before I was a part of online business, like I swear I would like, I would never speak. And even when I first got started, like two years ago, I was like, I will never be on camera. I'm never speaking. I don't want to take pictures by myself. Like I was so shy. <laughs> yeah. And so honestly, like that's one thing I would say is anyone can do this. You just have to push through and just keep doing it and you get better and better. And now I can do it without sweating. So it's great. <laughs> oh, very cool. Very cool. Awesome. All right, cool. Well, uh, Janine, thank you again for taking the time. Uh, I don't even know what time it is there. What time is it right now? 10 a.m. <laughs> oh, it's 10 a.m. Okay. So it's not too bad. Okay. Good. I thought I caught you too early. Well, I just want to thank you again for taking the time to do this interview. It's been really, uh, really awesome hearing your story. Yeah, of course. Thanks for having me. Yeah, for sure. So for everybody who's watching this uh, video and you're saying to yourself, I would love to be a digital rock star, just like Janine, and tell my story. Uh, we would love to hear your story. So there's a link down in the description there below. Click that link to get started. Just get started. And if you are been referred to this video by somebody else, just get back in touch with the person who shared this with you. Awesome. Thank you. You bet.